Every party needs some sparkle. Today I'm going to show you a creative way to display your basic sparklers. The first step is with a bamboo skewer. This is a 12 inch long bamboo skewer and this beautiful iridescent garland. This is really inexpensive. You can get it from any party store. And what you're gonna do is cut about one inch off, separate all that little tinsel and snip it with a pair of little scissors. And then inside this garland is wire. So you can twist the wire into a little circle and create kind of a little pom-pom of tinsel. And then with that, and a hot glue gun. I'm gonna squirt a little dab of glue right in that center where you twisted the wire, and on the blunt end of the skewer, just hold it in the hot glue. Straight up, just like that. Hold it for a few seconds, maybe five seconds. And there you go. You have a cute little pom-pom skewer. So I'll put that aside and pick up two sparklers and some pretty glittery tape. Off. about an inch of tape, grab your little skewer and two sparklers and just tape it together right at the bottom. Now you're going to need a way to light this, so to do that I've created these fun little tags that say let sparks fly, printed out a whole bunch on one piece of paper with a nice circle template for me so that I can go ahead and use a circle punch to pop them all out. This is a, a good way to streamline your process and you can do a beautiful display of these. Here, punched out three to start. Once you've punched out all your punches, you can see I've also made some guide marks for where the match is gonna weave through. And for that, I'm using a screw punch. First, I'm gonna do the tie on the top with a little punch. Then I'm just gonna switch out the bit on the top, secure in another bit that's a little bit larger. And that's a perfect size for the match to go through. So with two punches, and then you can take a match. And remember to put these, display these on a table that's high enough so that your children can't reach them because these are gonna have matches on them. We need a way to strike the match. And I have strike paper. This is different than, than regular um, sandpaper. It's match strike paper. And I'm using a different punch to separate it. It has sticky on the back. And I'm gonna put that right in the center on the back of my tag and secure it down. Now I have to attach this to my cute little display of sparklers. And for that, I'm using this pretty metallic thread. Snip off a little bit. I'm gonna fold the thread, it's probably about two and a half inches folded, so about four inches, let's say, of thread. And I'm just gonna fold it, loop it in to the tag, take those two tail ends, the loop like that. Pull it nice and taut and then tie it around our little fire cracker skewer and sparklers in a nice little knot. So your guests could slide this right off and then strike the match and light the sparklers. How cute is that? Leave any comments or questions below and thanks for watching Personalized.